From 13 News and the Virginian Pilot, this is In the Driver's Seat. Good morning, Hampton Roads. I'm Larry Prince, automotive editor for the Virginian Pilot, and we're here in the incredible garage of Bob Parrish of Chesapeake, and that's to spotlight a car show that's going on today at the Virginia Beach Airport at the Military Aviation Museum. It's the 38th annual Antique Automobile Club of America Tidewater Region Automobile Show. Now, this year they're spotlighting 100 years of Chevrolet, and that's why we're in Mr. Parrish's garage, because he has an incredible collection of Chevrolet, starting with this 1931 model. Now, this was right around the time that Chevy started to overtake Ford with its Model A. And this is just before the V8 Ford of 1932. Now, this is a sport coupe, and it's called a sport coupe because it has the stone guard up front, the marker lights right here, and wood graining on the interior. Now, it's also interesting because it has a rumble seat. And, uh, well, you know, they were always a little tricky to get into because you had to make sure that your left foot was free when you got to the top of the fender. And, of course, good girls didn't ride back there. But, of course, this car, while it's going to be at the show, isn't the only thing that's here. And I think we need to take a look at a couple of the other treats that are resting here. If you knew four-speed dual-quad positive traction 409, then you know what this is. It's a Chevrolet Impala SS. And I got to tell you, 425 horsepower, this thing is a beast. And it was a great image car for Chevrolet, which enjoyed a huge market share in these years, right around 25%, which is more than all of General Motors today. Of course, when people think of Chevrolet, they think of the Chevrolet Corvette, which is America's sports car. Now, this is a particularly rare sample. It's the 498th one built in 1958, and one of only 400 with fuel injection. Horsepower, right around 250. Now, these are the types of cars you're going to be seeing today at the Military Aviation Museum down there in Virginia Beach. And here's a reason to go today. You know, bad economy, need to stretch the dollar. It's $10 per car load, and that gives you admission to the show and the museum. And the museum usually costs $10 a person to get in. So that makes it a good deal. So runs 8 to 4, and uh, see you down there. For the Virginian Pilot and WVEC, I'm Larry Prince, and you are now in the driver's seat.